Hi, I am Ashish Tayama from Nokia. I am here at IEEE event at Kansas City, where Sprint and Nokia is showing innovations in 5G. So let's have a look. Why is 5G important for the industry? So right now we're at the cusp of the next industrial revolution called commonly known as Industry 4.0. This is where we need to achieve new levels of uh, automation to increase productivity. And with 5G's capabilities of ultra low latency, high reliability and massive machine type communication, we're going to see a huge change in the way we're able to operate machines and control machines in real time within the factory. Our 5G strategy is to take and deploy massive MIMO radios from Nokia and others uh, that will give us immediate LTE capacity increase and then over time will allow us to up upgrade with software to 5G NR. And by doing that, we don't need to climb the tower again and incur a lot of additional costs other than including the software in the radios. So specifically, we have the uh, massive MIMO uh, 64T, 64R radio that we're deploying commercially, already available in New York City, testing it there and the biggest market in the US. And uh, that, that radio is going to be deployed, like I said, in split mode. So 32 transmission, 32 receive antennas for LTE, and 32T, 32R for 5G in the future when that software is available next year. Hey, Daniel, so how can you summarize IEEE event for Sprint and Nokia? Right, Ashish, uh, this is all about building blocks, taking innovation into parts. First, uh, we believe that it starts in building the network ground up. It's taking the massive MIMO innovation that we have and enable Sprint to take their network into the new era. Building the LTE with multiple capacities and also augmenting that with 5G. But that's not all. I think that we have to do uh, more to reach out the excellence. First, we have to augment our own algorithms with artificial intelligence networks by using machine learning to improve even further the user experience. And we want to use that. But this takes us so far. What we want to, to demonstrate, and we have a few demonstrations here at the event, is to show that use case or 5G networks will enable new use cases. I'm showcasing here a proof of concept platform and an orchestrator that helps the developers of distributed mobile edge applications uh, to significantly reduce their time to market by using the uh, features of the platform that can give them uh, really low latency, reliability and scalability basically out of the box. What we are showing here at IEEE event is our airscale base station, which is the most compact airscale base station for massive MIMO, where we are showing LTE and 5G together, and we are able to get more than 2 Gbps throughput uh, in the most compact form. Nokia Bell Labs has a couple of innovations here. One of them is in the AI or machine learning algorithms, the cognitive deep learning algorithms to be able to identify the different types of traffics and the anomalies associated with those. And the second thing is the advances in our silicon. So the Reef Shark family of chips, which have the AI embedded compute capabilities inside them. When you couple those things together and also you put them into our airframe open edge server, that allows you to create a very powerful real time optimization system. In the next industrial revolution, we will need networks to go beyond. And by having a tactile experience, we can have probably remote experiences that we were not able to do that at the moment. And we expect this to be a ground up opportunity that operators like ourselves and Sprint to build their networks on. Great. So to me, that summarizes uh, most of what we wanted to show here at the event. 